Well, we begin here at noon with breaking news out of New York, where an earthquake with a preliminary magnitude of 4.7 shook America's largest city this morning. ABC's Derek Dennis has the latest details on the developing story. Millions of residents across parts of the Northeast reported feeling an earthquake Friday morning. You at home, you probably felt it. We just experienced an earthquake here uh, in the tri-state area. We're getting calls into our newsroom from Connecticut, Long Island, New Jersey, and of course, New York City. People feeling the shock. The U.S. Geological Survey confirms a quake was centered about four miles northeast of White House Station, New Jersey. WABC's Nina Pineda reporting live from her home. And I heard this rumbling, so I looked outside because I thought something happened with the, the boiler or they're, they're working on the pool, and I see this. Move, Roxy. Move. And I see the, the, this plant here. The fire department being dispatched in Long Valley, New Jersey, amid reports of multiple structures with damage. It just felt like a light shaking. I actually felt it uh, coming from the building. Uh, my roommate came out saying, oh, did you feel the earthquake? I was like, oh, yeah, it's just somebody doing laundry upstairs. I was sleeping in my bed, and the next thing I know, I just woke up and I feel my bed shaking. I was laying down, and my desk started shaking. I was like, this ain't normal. New York's Governor Kathy Hochul saying, my team is assessing impacts and any damage that may have occurred, and we will update the public throughout the day. Several airports, including BWI in Baltimore, Newark International Airport, and JFK are all on ground stop to check runways for damage from this quake. Derek Dennis, ABC News, New York. And reaction to this morning's earthquake is already pouring in. Former U of L head basketball coach Rick Matino, who's now at St. John's University in New York City, posted this on social media this morning saying he felt the earthquake while on a Zoom call with a recruit, even saying maybe the earthquake is a sign that that recruit is a musket for their program.